Hi, I'm naturalist Mandy from Cowan Lake State Park. Thanks for joining me today at the dam off of State Route 730. This is the parking lot you would use to access our spillway trail. Let's head on over to the trailhead and start our adventure. We have traveled from the parking lot across the 730 bridge to the trailhead. For your safety, please be mindful of the traffic and walk in a single file line along the edge of the road following the guardrail. Our trail team volunteers recently blazed all of the trails here at Cowan. As you can see here, spillway has been blazed with orange. Follow these markers and you won't get lost. One of the best parts about hiking during the winter is that there's no leaves on the trees to block your views. Off a of spillway trail, there's lots of beautiful views of the lake. Behind me, you can see the marina. We've reached the end of spillway trail here at Sprague Road. So for those of you who parked at the dam, you'll need to turn around now and hike 2.5 miles back to your car. If you would like a different view of this trail, you can park here at Sprague Road off of 730 and walk towards the dam. From this parking lot, if you look across the lake, you can see the campground beach. It's a beautiful view and a lot of herons and the bald eagles like to fly in this area. We are very close to Eagle Point where they fish from. Let's turn around and continue this adventure back to the car. As you hike Spillway Trail, you will wind around several coves. Be sure to stop and look for wildlife. We just witnessed two juvenile bald eagles lift up out of the cove behind us and take flight. Make sure you bring your binoculars and you'll get a good view of our eagles here at Cowan. Thanks for joining me on Spillway Trail for this winter hike here at Cowan Lake State Park. I hope you enjoyed this out and back five mile trail. For more hiking options during winter, please follow along with Ohio Department of Natural Resources YouTube channel to see hikes available across the state.